Hey there kids, how are you all doing today? I hope you're ready for an exciting adventure. Today I'm going to tell you a magical story about a brave little dragonfly named Dazzle. Are you ready? Let's dive in and see what amazing things Dazzle gets up to. Once upon a time in a lush green meadow filled with colorful flowers and buzzing bees, there lived a dragonfly named Dazzle. Dazzle wasn't just any dragonfly, he had the most vibrant shimmering wings you could ever imagine. They sparkled like tiny rainbows whenever the sunlight touched them. But you know what? Dazzle was also very shy. He often felt nervous around other insects and preferred to keep to himself. He loved to fly high and fast, feeling the wind rush past his wings, but he was scared to talk to others. He worried they might not like him or think he was strange. One sunny morning, Dazzle was zooming around, enjoying the warmth of the sun on his wings, when he heard a tiny cry. It was a sound he had never heard before, and it made him stop in his tracks. He stopped and looked around, and there, near the pond, was a little ladybug named Lila. She was struggling and looked very frightened. Lila had fallen into the water and couldn't get out. Oh no! She was flapping her tiny wings desperately, but it was no use. Dazzle wanted to help, but he was scared. His heart pounded in his chest as he thought about what to do. What if he wasn't strong enough? What if he couldn't save her? These thoughts swirled in his mind, making him feel even more anxious. What if he made things worse? What if he accidentally hurt Lila instead of helping her? The fear of failure was almost paralyzing. But then, he remembered something his wise old grandmother had told him. Courage isn't about not being afraid. It's about doing what's right, even when you are afraid. Her words echoed in his mind, giving him a spark of hope. Taking a deep breath, Dazzle flew down to the edge of the pond. He knew he had to try, no matter how scared he felt. He carefully stretched out his long, strong tail and reached for Lila. His heart was racing, but he focused on the task at hand. Grab on, Lila, he called. His voice was steady, even though he felt anything but. Lila clutched onto Dazzle's tail, and with all his might, Dazzle pulled her out of the water. It was a struggle, but he didn't give up. They both fluttered to a nearby leaf to rest. They were exhausted but relieved. Thank you, Dazzle, said Lila, her eyes sparkling with gratitude. You saved me, I don't know what I would have done without you. Dazzle blushed, his wings shimmering even more brightly. He felt a warm glow inside, a mix of pride and happiness. I was really scared, he admitted, but I knew I had to help you. I couldn't just leave you there. Lila smiled. That's what makes you a true hero, Dazzle. Not your wings, but your heart. Your bravery and kindness are what truly shine. From that day on, Dazzle and Lila became the best of friends. They spent their days exploring the meadow and helping other insects in need. Dazzle learned that being brave doesn't mean you're never scared. It means you face your fears to do what's right, even when it's hard. It means you face your fears to do what's right. And kindness? Well, kindness is the most powerful magic of all. It can change the world, one small act at a time. Well, kindness is the most powerful magic of all. It can bring light to the darkest places and make the world a better place. So kids, remember Dazzle's lesson. Be brave, be kind, and never be afraid to help someone in need. You never know how much your actions can mean to someone else. Be brave, be kind, and never be afraid to help someone in need. You have the power to be a hero too. Just like Dazzle, you can make a difference. You have the power to be a hero too. So go out there, spread your wings, and let your kindness shine. Thanks for listening, and until next time, keep being awesome. Bye-bye. And remember, the world needs more heroes like you.